Hi, my name is Marcy Evans. I am a registered dietitian in private practice in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and like to think of myself as not only a business owner, but also an entrepreneur. So I was invited to talk with you a little bit about what my day-to-day like is on the job, which is tricky to do as an entrepreneur because my days look pretty different from one another. So I'll talk a little bit about the things that keep me busy and hope to encourage and inspire those of you who are thinking about doing something similar. So the foundation of my business still is nutrition counseling. When I started out as a business owner, that's what I spent 100% of my time doing, providing nutrition counseling for people in recovery from eating disorders. So we're an outpatient practice here in the Boston area, really focusing in on working with folks in recovery from eating disorders, chronic dieting, wanting to work on body image. And that's really the heart of my passion. But over time, things evolved for me a little bit where I wanted to expand the reach of what I was doing to not only treating individuals, which I still do, but also training and inspiring other clinicians who want to do the same. And I do that a few different ways. One way I do that is providing supervision. So supervision is often a phrase that is new to dietitians because it's not something we learn about in school, but it's essentially a place where dietitians who also work in the field of eating disorders can talk about practice-related questions or questions related to the work they're doing with their clients, case-related questions, dilemmas they're having on treatment teams, and I provide clinical suggestions and guidance on how to problem solve the dilemmas that they're facing. So I love providing and I'm so passionate about giving clinical supervision. So I spend a fair amount of time coaching and training dietitians in that format. I also do a lot of speaking. So on any given day of the week, I might be spending a lot of time reading the literature and doing research and developing a new talk or I do, or and I do, a lot of online trainings as well. So if you go to teachable.marcrd.com, you can see that I have an online training platform where I have developed a number of self-study courses on the topics of nutrition counseling for eating disorders, body image, as well as digestive concerns and eating disorders, and looking at the interface between those two. So, I also spend a fair bit of my days looking at the research and putting together those online courses. And the last thing that's really keeping me busy right now is work that I'm doing with Simmons College here in Boston. And I am working on and supporting the development of a dietetic internship that specializes in the treatment of eating disorders. And this has been an ongoing piece of work for me over the past few years and continues to evolve and expand and grow. So I'm helping the dietetic internship side of things as well as the graduate level coursework. And it has been an amazing passion project of mine. I really like to think about the work that I do as kind of fitting into two different arenas. One is still doing that client work, and the other is helping to build and inspire and encourage the work of other dietitians looking to explore the field of eating disorders and expand their knowledge and expertise in the field of eating disorders. So I hope that gives you a little bit of a glimpse into what my days are like, really dappling in all of those different things and juggling that depending on what the needs are in any given week and um, I guess one more thing that I should mention that I also do a lot of as an entrepreneur is working with my marketing and I do that predominantly in the social media sphere so if you want to get to know me a little bit more and see the work that I'm up to or the things that I'm passionate about you can certainly connect with me online all of my social media handles are at Marcy RD that's at M-A-R-C-I-R-D thanks so much and best of luck to you bye